this match is going right down to the wire, Lee Isla, and I know I'm excited right now. Will this be the first time championship for an unknown George Brooks, or will Dave Husted win back to back and be the first to have three? Only two more frames to find out. Oh, and the messenger was called and answered. Well, we've been watching that messenger just come short the last couple of frames. That time for George Brooks. The pin went to the sidewall and knocked over the 10 pin. Now, if he could strike here in the ninth frame, he would increase his lead to 11 pins and really put a lot of pressure on David Husted. Big deep breath, a little more time. George Brooks has a lot of regional experience and has had to help him through this week. Well, it's helped him, but he's he's dug deep and, and found something from somewhere I don't know where it came from. Oh, no, no, no. And you heard him, oh, no, no, no. Well, Leila, he seemed to know that that was a bad shot as soon as he let it go. Got, here we go, we'll see a replay of this shot. Marshall. Got the ball down kind of quick, and it doesn't make the turn back to pocket. We talked about the adrenaline going in the match between Liz Johnson and how faster their feet go. Yeah, that's that's definitely a shot that he got a little quick on as we see the pins leaving the 210. Now we'll see. He knows that's not a good shot. And Dave, David decided to see that shot. Well, George still in good position if he can muster up the spare conversion and he dropped that ball actually it looked like he's stuck at the line he passed the ball up to the two pin marshal i don't understand why he tried to play it this way he, he throws the ball with the reverse hook to try and get back to the 210 i can understand if it was the 2810 but there was no sleeper he loses more pin count because he doesn't get any of them. Now he finds himself in a deficit position. Dave Hughes set up for the ninth frame. And like the champion he is, he climbs all over that break. And running it out all the way over to lane one. Now Dave Husted working on a 217 pace. The best that George Brooks can do right now would be 214. So Dave needs to get a mark in the 10th frame and then fill eight on his on his uh, second ball. And he's the winner. A lot at stake. Even Dave Husted taking extra time. And he's finishing on that left lane that's been giving the bowlers a little bit of trouble. Remember, the ball's been hanging on this lane. It actually hung again. Yeah. He was fortunate just to leave the 10 pin. Seven was the, the last to go there. Well, the seven pin was standing along with a couple others for a second, but just the 10 pin remaining. He's missed one earlier in the match. He needs this. And he picks it up perfectly, the Isla. You know, what was going through his head, Marshall? He missed the 10 pin this frame. He pretty much had to have that spin. Well, I think Dave Houston just completely forgot about the 10 pin that he missed and just went on with the work that he had to do ahead of him. He now needs eight pins to shut out George Brooks and become the first to win back-to-back -back U.S. Opens. And the first to win three U.S. Open championships. Well, here it is, Leila. This is the shot he wants. If he could just hit the pocket, that'll do it. Back-to-back -back U.S. Open championships for David Houston, and he is spent. Three-time U.S. Open champion. Beautiful. Oh, that's great sportsmanship from George Brooks. And uh, Dave Husted gave it everything he had. He got a good break. George opened in the ninth frame, but he was able to do it as necessary to win this tournament. Meanwhile, George Brooks finishing out. Nothing to be ashamed of. Both incredible all week long. This man adds another title to his long list of accomplishments. Now has 13 national titles. Another great, it's a great victory for Dave, and, and I know that this meant a lot to him to, to do something that's that historical. Thank I think you. He's more to David than just to win a tournament. And George Brooks actually one more strike. It's going to look good on paper. 216 to 214. If George Brooks can strike here, boy, what.
what a match, what a final here at the Market Square Arena.